Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Larry Nix Moore. I'm a chiropractor here in the South Minneapolis Clinic. Um, welcome to the clinic here. This is where we have our adjustment here on this side, and then we have our therapy bay on this side. So you guys follow me. As you can see, we have three roller tables. This is what this really works on the spine here. And if you guys come with me, we also have what we call EMS. That's what we have. Um, those, these machines will help use electrical stimulation to help to relax the muscles. Here on this side, we have our two adjustment tables. This is where we adjust our patients. And if you come with me, we also have a massage chair too, if you ever you would like to sit down or if you're not able to lay down. And then come with me. This is our massage room. Our clinic here utilizes massage methods. If you ever come in from car accidents, work accidents, you just have bodily pain and you want to just be uh, seen for massage, we also have massage in-house. If you follow me here, this is where we have our x-rays. Here at the South Minneapolis Clinic, we do digital x-rays here. Uh, we would have the patients come in, would have them stand in front of the x-ray machine and then take the x-rays and then the x-rays would be put onto the computer. We also have images on the side here so that we can uh, um, explain to the patients what a good uh, spine or neck area would look like. So if you guys can see here, everything here on this side, those are going to be what looks good on the spine. As we move towards the right side here, the spine gets a little bit worse. This is what we can use as a comparison for our patients. Here at our clinic, uh, you'll be coming in from the front door. This is our front office. You'll be meeting our uh, front office lady here. As we come over here, we have two adjustment bays. This is gonna be room one. This is gonna be another room which we adjust our patients here. This is our chiropractic table. And then we also have a spine to explain to the patients what's going on. If patients ever have any issues, um, we will tell them and explain to them where they're having a lot of their pain. We have tools here too. We use ArthroStim. This is a tool that we use in our clinic. Patients prefer more of a tool base. We use tools as well. Otherwise, we use our hands to adjust the patients. We also utilize the Theragun. This helps to massage the body a little bit. So if you ever need a little bit of massage, we do quick massage too as well. Here we have images too in our clinic here. Um, this is the, the image of the nervous system. So when patients kind of come in, you've heard the word sciatica, uh, things like that, migraines. That has a lot to do with some of the nerves that play into um, the body here. So when something is pinched, people get often pain that goes down the leg, even sometimes to the foot. So as chiropractors, we adjust those certain bones or certain, those certain segments so that it doesn't put so much pressure on the nerves. This is an image of the road to recovery. After some time, um, we work with our patients. It can take some time, a couple weeks to even months, depending on the type of injury you have. But the real uh, synopsis of this is that uh, it's going to take time, but as we go throughout this process, you should be feeling better, you should be feeling normal, and how you should feel before you had your injury. Room two, this is uh, the second room which we adjust our patients here. Again, we have a spine model to explain to our patients what, um, where and what might be the issue. Um, over here, we have some more images here that we can explain to our patients why they might be having headaches. So this is the image right over here. So this is an image of uh, what patients may have whiplash injuries if they've ever been involved in car accidents um, or neck pain. This image explains a little bit of why you may be having um, neck pain. Could be tissue damage, could be something compressing on the nerve. Uh, so we do motions, what we call orthopedic tests here in the clinic. That's going to help uh, give us an explanation of why you may be having some of those pain. Um, here we have a model of the skeleton. As a chiropractor, we work with the, uh, the back bones, uh, otherwise known as the, the, the spines. And what happens is that when people get into accidents, uh, such as car accidents or work accidents, um, our bones tend to get out of alignment or start to twist and turn. That causes a lot of pressure on the nerves, as well as the blood vessels if it's in the neck. That can cause a lot of back pain, 
a lot of dizziness. You can get a lot of leg pain if it's the low back. As chiropractors, we use our hands to adjust these areas so that we can correct them so that you don't have the pinching of the nerves or blood vessels or tightness of the muscles. Here at our clinic, we also use massage as a method to help relax the muscles so that when we adjust the patient, the adjustments stick. Be a chiropractor's important or chasing though, to motor J. Um, you're there, uh, go to the more, the the patano, the body, uh, new comb gina, ton the day, pay she bit a day, no patako, new two, or in the day, new two, new two title, leafy fano, to all need a pata here, need young guy, ping no do hina. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Perez. I've been a chiropractor for the past 22 years. We have been serving the communities in Minneapolis, St. Paul, and surrounding suburbs. Um, we specialize in uh, taking care of patients who have been involved in car accidents, work injuries, and also patients that have acu acute or chronic type of pain. If you need any help, please free feel free to give us a call at any of our locations. Hello, I'm Dr. Perez. This is Dr. Mua. We are chiropractors and we are so happy to be working with the Muang community. We have clinics in Minneapolis, St. Paul and the surrounding areas. Anybody that needs help, car accidents, work injuries, would be more than happy to help you and take care of you. It's also not good, Dr. Larry Sumoa. You have any chiropractic care. You look at your shining, what you should do to motor her learning. What do you think? What do you think? 